Good afternoon and welcome back to www.shoespotmarina.com On the lot today we have this awesome entry-level cruiser it's a 1982 Campion 24 foot it has a two foot wooden swim deck swim platform on the back of it there's actually lots of wood all around the boat it's got a Mercruiser 260 inboard outboard power package with an Alpha 1 stern drive. It's in very good shape. It's been through our shop for a mechanical inspection and it's passed everything in that. These current owners have done a lot of work mechanically on the boat over the last couple of years. It comes on this painted Calkins tandem axle trailer. All the woodwork's been refinished. It's very clean. Because of the price we haven't done a full polish on it. But we are only asking $9,900. And this is a great package to get your family out on the water and a low risk investment in order to decide whether or not you like boating before you invest in a more expensive boat and uh, in fact that's exactly what the last two owners have done um, both of the last two owners have moved from this boat up into a bigger cruiser because they've both enjoyed boating so much it does have this very nice folding four-step swim boarding ladder on it trim tabs full camper canvas and we'll hop inside and take a look at some of the other features in there. Alright, and here we have the cockpit of the 1982 Campion 24 foot. A nice clean layout back here. Uh, this actually does pull out to a seat just ahead of you here, which is a neat feature. You've got a lot of room to put a couple of nice deck chairs in the back here. And that's really going to give you a lot of flexibility as far as your usage for the back of the boat here. Make it very nice for fishing and all that kind of stuff. A very clean layout. And I'll just uh, hop over the edge here and we'll uh, take a little tour of the inside. And as you can see, all of the woodwork has been very nicely refinished. A lot of uh, convenient storage for bottles on the boat and glasses and cup holders all over the place. Very nicely set up that way. It does have full camper canvas and you'll see pictures of the full canvas set up on the website. As we take a tour through here, the clean theme continues. Redone upholstery up here. We've got an eagle fish finder. 850 engine hours. It's probably just over half the engine's life and with most people's usage at an average of 30 to 40 hours a year uh, there's still at minimum 10 or 15 years of life left on that motor if it is well maintained. And as we take a step down here once again very nice and clean down here you're gonna hear me get bored of me saying that but it's true A nice bright setup down here, lots of windows, your, your side windows open up and the forward hatch does open so while underway you can force some air through the place. I like this cargo net storage on either side of the bunk, the V-berth up here. And filler cushions obviously go in here and make this a nice, quite a large bed actually by the looks of it, which is a very nice setup. And as we turn around, all the wood is in very nice shape. Surprising amount of room in the aft cabin. Nice Danforth plow style anchor there. And uh, those are your filler cushions for the forward V-berth. And uh, more storage for bottles and glasses here. And then in here we have the head 
Once again, very nice and clean in here. Currently, the boat does not have a water system. So although there is a sink here, the, uh, the pump is not hooked up. Now, it looks to me like the pump should be able to be hooked up, and you should be able to use it uh, in the galley here for the galley sink. It is a dual burner alcohol stove, which is a very nice feature. It does also have an ice box right here, as well as a stainless steel barbecue that comes with the boat as well. I love the, uh, the look of the teak and holly floor. Very, very cool. And lots of storage on this boat, actually. Quite surprising. We'll come back out into the cabin here, into the cockpit. This could be your view every day, right here. The beautiful Shuswap Lake. And I'll pop open the engine hatch, we'll have a look in there. And here we have the engine compartment of the 1982 Campion. You can see that it does have a dual battery setup with a battery switch. Mercruiser 260. I believe is actually a 350 V8. Might be a 305 or 5 liter. But I think that is actually a 5.7. I'll have to double check my numbers on that and you'll see the correct numbers on the website. At any rate, it is nice and clean down here, lots of space. I believe this water pump here just has to be hooked back up in order to make the water system work. We've replaced a couple of trim lines for the trim tabs. Mechanical inspection report is all available on our website. And there you have that. So there you have it, it's a 1982 Campion 240 with a 2 foot extended swim platform, about 26 feet overall, a perfect entry level cruiser for you and your family to decide if that's something you want to invest more money in. It's got a Merc Cruiser 260 inboard outboard on the trailer, we're asking $9,900. Come on by Shoeswap Marina or check out shoeswapmarina.com for the mechanical inspection report, more pictures. Have yourselves a fantastic day and hopefully we can help you get out there and enjoy the lake style.